taking all my energy Cleaning up, I'm taking care of all myself and me Drinking coffee, take a sip, they say I'm sparkling Manifest it, write it down, you know it's happening what up beauty gang today has not been my day it's probably been one of the worst days that i've had in a very long time on some personal stuff i might touch on at some point during this weekly vlog however it's my aunt's 71st birthday today my aunt marcia y'all saw her in a couple weekly vlogs back she's the vegan makes bomb tamales veggie burgers etc etc today is her birthday and i decided to do a little surprise whatever whatever me and josh we just finished decorating our apartment we did a nice little happy birthday situation got her a lot of gifts some flowers a birthday birthday card and birthday numbers more cards and then we're gonna like cook her a meal tonight i'm also gonna give her a makeover I'm gonna do her hair just get her feeling good and looking bomb for her birthday because she deserves it i'm excited it's the first time i've done this and she lost her husband passed away earlier this year so this would have been her first birthday without him i refuse to let my loved ones spend a birthday alone if i have anything to say with it about it or whatever so josh and i literally just got back from a road trip wedding we had this weekend this past weekend in ohio with his family we got back around midnight last night woke up this morning had the dramatics and then ran to the stores got this stuff together and how's it go i don't know how this video is going to turn out but i'm trying to do the best i can but just turning on the camera documenting my life my experience and taking y'all along the journey and i got the stevie wonder happy birthday on deck okay we ready <laughs> But my yard looks horrible. <laughs> I need somebody to come and do their yard. Ooh, what is this? Oh, this is heavy too. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Look how you deck it out. <laughs> oh wow. Self care, honey. <laughs> We're doing a transformation today. Okay. Body scrub. Oh. Smell that. Um, as soon as my knee gets better, I can get in the tub and soak. Smell it though, Auntie, so you get motivated. Oh yeah, it smells good. Cashmere vanilla. Mm -hmm. okay. What'd you say? You know about all of these, huh? <laughs> Dr. Till. Mm -hmm. yeah. I'm good with Dr. Till. Oh, satin scarf. Mm -hmm. I'm wrapping my hair. Oh, wow. This is a lot. Oh. <laughs> it's your birthday. Vegan ceramide. They're eye patches. Oh my goodness. So just when you want to have a little self-care day, you place them right under your eyes. They help brighten them and bring life into them. Look at her face. <laughs> Do one tonight. Uh-huh. Oh. <laughs> we'll be using that today, but you'll be taking that home. <laughs> Alcohol free. Oh. Oh, for your hair. Girl. Well, you know I need help with this. <laughs> You're not even going to exaggerate. You know I need help. Wow. I got this you. Is beautiful. <laughs> uh huh. Oh, this, this. Oh, for the edges. Yes, oh. ma'am. You gonna deck me out? We gonna hook you up. Well, hook me up. Mm -hmm. Look, uh -huh. I, I just want I just wanted you to hook this up. I will do I, it I, all. I, I look, look, I'm just gonna let it happen. Mm -hmm. The last time I had that done was when I worked at Carson Peary Scott and the women came in from the Uh-huh. Oh yeah, you got coconut oil. Oh yeah, I keep this too. Mm -hmm. Epsom oh, salt. Wow. Wonderful, wonderful. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I had to start back. You know, you get used to caring for people and you forget to care for yourself. yourself. I'm glad I didn't have to write it out. You pieced it together pretty quick. That was the goal for this birthday. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
Yeah, I mean, I haven't given up, but I have given up in some ways. So I'm thankful for that. I'm thankful for everything that God is doing through you. Mm. He, he kind of pushed me to come and get her. <laughs> I was like, I'll meet you down here. <laughs> But she kind of figured that I might turn around and say, no, I'll see y'all another time, because I will do that. Mm. Sister's do keeper. That. Got out to my deco. <laughs> oh, it smells good. Put you on camera. If it wasn't good. You look great. I will make the effort. Yes. 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 Oh, it may be different, but I'll make the effort. Good. Say that again. Yeah. yeah. We already got her on camera. We got her on camera I saying will it. Make the effort. I said it already. <laughs> <laughs> we could move on with the next step in tonight's festivities. Okay. I'm mm -hmm. ready. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Marsha. Happy birthday to you. Thank you all. May the good. Actually, this is your this is, your is a vegetable and quinoa stir fry. It's gonna okay. be a big freeze. So I know if you need your dietary needs. Mm -hmm. wow. Wonderful, wonderful. Thank you so much, baby. Appreciate it. Wow. Looks great. That salad looks good. Thank you, Heavenly Father, for this food we're about to receive. Thank you for the thoughtful Issy and Josh and Angie. Lord, you love each one of us so much. Thank you for being in them and giving them the heart and the mind to share this with me. I ask you to bless them in their ever endeavor, and I thank you for them. Be with us now as we eat and as we fellowship with each other, we pray. And thank you in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. And my wish is private. Yeah, Amen. please do. Okay! Thank 
you so much. What up, guys? Happy Friday, Junior. I'm not allowed to talk to you guys long. Cause we already late by a half hour. Because we are late for a salsa dancing class. That we just, ooh, the sun is blinding. Hopefully the melanin is popping. We just arrived to, we took a salsa dancing class earlier this year for a collab Josh did with Groupon and really enjoyed it. Ended up letting them talk us into signing up for two more, well, paying for two more sessions ahead of time. And then at some point this year, getting it done. We decided nine days before our wedding to do this. So here we go. So unfortunately, our session was, a, well that was a fast 40 minutes, but because we, we showed up, like 30. the traffic was trash, you guys. So we only, the sessions are only an hour long. He had somebody else after us, but we did get a couple little moves in and refreshers. Yeah. This is why so, I was ready to get in there. That's what we needed. Yep. Note to self, never go salsa dancing and in particular try a dip without a secure wig, y'all. That was probably one of the most embarrassing things that have happened to me in 2022. Oh, that's. I'm that's... just glad it wasn't a lot of people around, but like. <laughs> My wig, I thought I was so cute with the dip. Wig flopped right off, y'all. Right in front of, is it Desarge? Right in front of Desarge. Desarge. Man, I promise you, it took everything in me not to just start busting out laughing right there, because I knew there was a lot of people, when I started laughing, then you would definitely get mad at me. Because I was gonna definitely get mad at you. Exactly. Attention. Way too much attention, but at the same time. No, bro. Hilarious. No, bro. Hilarious. This thing flopped right off, y'all. He eight. probably thought it was my hair, yep. too, he so he was short. <laughs> yeah, he was shook. I could see it in his face, he was shook. <laughs> That's so embarrassing. Oh my gosh. We're gonna go home. We have some new dance. We have to practice. Yeah, not the stars thinks she's bald head. I ain't bald head though. The this is the second so. time. Yeah, I've worn a wig both times we've come here. I'm gonna shock him one day. The stars definitely. But he head. just told us, y'all, he's turning 72 on Monday. He looks amazing. He's been a, a salsa dancing teacher for 40 something years now. Yeah. So that's what keeps like older people youthful still. You, you have to moving. keep moving. Yeah. The name of the game is move it or lose it. Yeah, honestly. If you stop moving, you gonna start losing. Tell them, say it again. If you don't start moving, you gonna start losing. Period. You might start gaining, if you know what I mean. I think we all know what you mean, especially after college, that 15 can set in, and this is why I be telling y'all, I've been there before too. This was post-college for me when I gained all that weight and whatnot, and I had to turn into a lifestyle journey uh, for health reasons, but I had stopped moving my body. That's how I gained almost 200 pounds. Okay. You didn't gain 200 pounds. Almost, but, well, okay, I was almost 200 pounds total. Baby, I didn't you gain wasn't two no almost 200. Baby, I was 190 something. When we, that's why I, I freaked myself out when we were in Atlanta. I stepped on that scale and was 190. Yeah, I'll never forget that number. That's when I said, okay, I gotta get my shit together, and I needed to start moving my body again. I That's why I be trying to. me off when you said you only gained 200. Yeah, yeah. I didn't say I'd it in the right way. With you with that Shut up, Josh. <laughs> anyway, that's why I be trying to motivate you guys. Like, at bare minimum, try to move your body every day, whether it's walking for 15 minutes. What's some other stuff that can do? But for the lazy, because it's okay. Walking is probably the walking laziest. Walking is the laziest you can like, <laughs> That's probably as low as you can go. But like, <laughs> <laughs> at least walk, <laughs> all right, guys? At bare minimum. At bare minimum, get up, yeah. move a little bit. There's a couple of like, I might have to do a video of like some daily movements that are very simple that yeah. you should do every day mm -hmm. just to just make to sure that mobile. your body works. Yeah. yeah. This is basic body awareness. You move it, or you, you lose it. it. In place squats, just a little, you know, just 10 of those. 
that's it make sure the knees work because we've been talking to our friends too who are also athletes the knees y'all all our knees well josh's knees he'd be My working on his great. his knees are great because he actually does like a lot of exercises in particular strength in his knees but for those of us who don't my knees crack when I bend, y'all, and when I sit, and I'm just thinking, we don't even have kids yet. I'm on the movement journey. He's brought me to the other side. Not completely to his side, but I'm heading in that direction because I want to stay right. young and youthful. And even my mom, she's so active and youthful because she she works out more than both of us do. Her knees are better than mine. She hit that, like, deep squat, remember? Yeah. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Do you want this? Yes! So we found this. It's oh, my gosh. So Today is not my day. No. How do you know it's closed? Lord said so. No. Yeah, Lord not a soul in there. I'm done, y'all. I don't even know what I'll see y'all again. See, now the sun just blinded me and stuff. Peace out, bro. <laughs> Sesame oil and the soy sauce both matter to make you, the flavor. You're the sesame sauce to my. Huh? You're the, you're the sesame oil to my, to my uh, soy, soy sauce. sauce. I could be sesame oil if you want to be soy sauce, but I like soy sauce. I would like for my name to be soy sauce. <laughs> I know you would. <laughs> you don't want to be sesame oil. Of course you don't want to be sesame oil. Sesame oil. <laughs> new wig as y'all can see i am in the car bay is in the cut he is actually me and my deco chauffeur <laughs> mama in the cut i know you want to say something go ahead well, happy friday yes hope everybody's wonderful today <laughs> miss ya <laughs> ma and i are actually en route to go bridal dress shopping so the tea on that is we were supposed to fly out to atlanta this week because yeah, most of y'all know it by this point i'm getting my wedding dress customized from scratch the designer is in atlanta we were supposed to go out there this week for the fitting and all of that but i'll save that story time for another time because some things has been very interesting this wedding process has been very interesting anyway though long story short because the dress won't be ready until next week designer is flying out her assistant to fit me in the dress here at my home so therefore my our mother-daughter trip had to get canceled because there was no point of us going out there but we still wanted that mother-daughter experience of trying on dresses and whatnot so my deco came up with the beautiful idea to why not let's try on some beautiful beautiful gowns and some, some champagne yeah i really hope they have champagne ma because this was a big thing that she keeps on mentioning <laughs> sipping on some champagne just trying on some dresses I want to try on like various styles. Obviously, I know what my wedding dress is gonna be, but so there's so many different like selections and stuff and styles that you can get from princess to mermaid to whatever. So I'm excited to see what they have and just to have this moment with my mom. So yeah, we're doing a whole fake faux wedding dress shopping experience. And I'm telling the people that I'm getting married next year. Don't do this at home, kids, and don't judge. Just enjoy the ride. All right, see y'all. We made it, you guys. Josh just dropped us off. We are on CPT, but it's okay. We made it nonetheless. Ultimate bride, it's a second floor. <laughs> Let's go. Mm -hmm. that I want to try on. She said this one is $51,000.
Every bead is pounded by hand. Oh my goodness. Make that 360, dog. Wow, I can't. Oh. <laughs> it is gorgeous. It's on, girl. <laughs> I'll give you guys another. Everyone too small, so they only have certain sizes. Like, yeah, for samples, those are the samples. So if they don't fit, they're like, you can't try it. Right. I'm gonna do this too thick. That one's probably about the size zero. Oh, princess, that's a long, that's the longest string thus far. Ooh, how's that back? I like this actually. Cause I thought it was just. Up here, the rest was like big. I like that it's a little bit like such. Yes. Oh, I wonder, is that gonna be zipped? Is this gonna be zipped all the way up if it was my size? Or does it have this type of back? It's gonna be zipped up right here. Okay. And then this um, will come up higher and it won't be red. So it's supposed to be underneath the skin, so okay. we'll have to switch it up to everything. Mm -hmm. I don't think you look comfortable with it. Hmm. As comfortable as you the were the other day. You yeah. just had that confidence about it. Yeah. You look questionable about this one. Because sometimes simple is best too, though, you know? I'm not as comfortable as the other two that I like. Right. You walked out it's elegantly though. like a queen. Yeah. It fits very nice. Okay, yeah. Mm -hmm. It is gorgeous. It's very unique. Yeah, I like that it's different. It has a split in the front. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> That's gorgeous. Based on what personality I want to be that day, I guess. <laughs> kind of stand on your tippy toes. Like you have heels. It's like a glove. Like I bought this box. <laughs> I love this. Okay. I do too, you see. In fact, what's your favorite? Is that your so favorite far? so far? Yes. Yeah. All right, you guys. So we made it out. Our first little experience. What What are your thoughts? I thought each of every game Oh my gosh. Okay, first and foremost. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But I did like the mermaid. The mermaid was your favorite. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Comment below what was you guys' favorite, by the way. And I don't remember if we got on video that last dress I just tried on. It had the split. Mm -hmm. That was beautiful. Yes. If I was to do things over again, that might have been the one. <laughs> anyway, um, we are waiting for our Uber now to pick us up. We didn't get the champagne experience, so we might try this again. You know how people, the wedding crashers? We mm -hmm. might bridal shop crash next week <laughs> or something before the wedding, just to experience, you know, something different. But something I will say that I noticed was like, I'm not to put this lightly, but the bridal shopping experience is as if it's not for us. I could do a little bit more research to see if there's like a black bridal shop or boutique, but that's kind of disappointing. Morning. But what I will say in the same breath, I don't know the statistics on this, but like my, the woman who's designing my dress, black owned, majority, if not all her clients are black. Mm -hmm. So I feel like there's a lot of black brides that get their dresses customized. That might be it too. Mm -hmm. And I, I wouldn't be surprised because a lot of the prices of these dresses are the same price you would pay if not right. substantially more getting it from a bridal shop. You can have something completely customized for yourself based off your design and your wants mm -hmm. and like pay for what you're asking for instead of something that's already been designed by somebody else. So interesting, however you want to peel it, but that first dress I tried on, it was $51,000. That's what I'm talking about. Like, what? <laughs> Never that. But anyway, that was our experience, y'all. So yes, mm -hmm. I got it. It is coming closer. It is. Closer. Eight days, Mom. Mm -hmm. And you're going, you know, you had a glow, didn't you? I think so. Let me, let me step more into the light real quick. Get the glow. the light real quick. There's the glow. <laughs> what up, you guys? It is Saturday. 
and Bay and I are actually en route to the super cool Lexus event that we were invited to in Chicago, like a Millennium Park area. We've never been before. We've never had an experience like this before. So having a little date night on a Lexus. They're actually picking us up. We're kind of going down right now to the chauffeur and some electric car. It's the new Lexus. Lexus electric car, so I'll be taking you guys. Are you calling it a Lexus? Lexus and Lexus. It's a Lexi Lex. Yeah. yeah. They have a car on display, you guys, with this sexy peanut butter interior. This is what? This is, really this is gorgeous. And it's fire candy red on the outside. Happy Sunday, beauty gang. We have a little glam situation going on in here. She has all her makeup set up and whatnot because it's the countdown, y'all. We are six days away, our wedding day. So wild, still digesting. But we wanted to do a pre-wedding makeup trial just so the day of the wedding, we're not like scrambling and try to figure out a look or like if I'm satisfied with X, Y, and Z. So she's gonna be doing my makeup today. And I guess I might show y'all. I might show y'all a little glimpse or whatever. She'll be doing my makeup and my mom's makeup though next week, Saturday. And then might have one of her girlfriends, another makeup artist, tag team, some of my other girls who are gonna be getting dressed with that day and just like there with me that morning. Again though, we're not doing that formal bridal party anything but just wanting to be around surrounded by my girls you know that feminine energy i'm looking forward to it but yeah about to get this little face beat going on some bridal makeup which is so weird to say i don't know why it's so weird but okay here's tony okay always here i'll give you guys little updates in between about to make some magic per usual to show you and ask you uh -oh. okay oh. and i got i got tony here with me hi mom but hi, tony, girl. There she is. Hi. so the green is just that would possibly be reception energy we don't even know for sure if we're gonna do it or not and then we'll do like the little fake falsy lashes i put underneath sometimes but if you could just ignore the green this is what it's kind of looking like Cause I don't even see the green. No, no. Go a little closer. No, I'm a, I'm a close. Oh, oh, I see. Oh, oh gorgeous. It just brings your eyes out even more. Thank you. You look like a bride. You, you think do. so? Especially when your hair, yes. all, all that comes together. Yes, that hair. Oh my goodness, the makeup, Tony. <laughs> Beat by Tony. <laughs> Beat by Tony. Okay. You made that face, girl. I just put makeup on. Oh, see, see they she said, You made the face. She just put the makeup on. <laughs> <laughs> you 
Gucci, what's poppin'? What's Gucci, what's poppin'? What's Gucci, what's poppin'? What's Gucci, beauty gang? So, as y'all can tell by the title, this is, actually, what is gonna be the title? Something to the effect of pre-wedding maintenance and self-care. Cause I'm getting married this weekend. It's kind of a crazy statement to say, but it is true. I got my husband to be in the car with me and we are en route to our first, well, this is the only thing I think we're doing together self care wise, but. And we're late. Yeah, we are late. But we are headed to the spa to get some pedicures. I'm also gonna get a massage and I didn't know, oh, you already trimmed up your hands. Okay, they was looking kind of crazy earlier this way. Nice, nice. All right, I wasn't nice, sure nice, if you were gonna nice. get a manicure or yeah, something, you know? I take care of myself. Mm -hmm. You do. We got a lot going on this week. We got four days. Four days until I do at this point. How you feel? Feeling like I could say I do today and I'd be great. Huh. Man, cool as a cucumber. I am all good. I've been waiting for this moment for years now. So, for people like, are you nervous, are you nervous? No, I want it to be done, to be honest with you, but like, I'm good. I got the speech down. Uh-huh. We got the intros down. Uh-huh. We got everything else set in place. We do, we do. We done pay people good money. I have to trust them. Yeah. Otherwise, I'm gonna feel like a fool for spending that much money. That's facts. That's facts. I would say at this point, would you say we're in the 90 percentile of being done with like wedding decisions? Come on. Okay, because <laughs> obviously the man's experience is very different from the woman's. Because I've been having drama with my dresses, although my reception dresses did deliver yesterday. They were saying they were going to deliver on the 30th, which is the day before our wedding. So God came through for your girl. Those delivered um, way above expected time. And then it's just, yeah, yeah. I'm trying to think of all everything and talk at one time, but I'm going to just take y'all through the process. We're about to try to pop in here um, to this nail shop because we are on CP tea time all right y'all let the wedding yeah. let the wedding festivities begin uh, Hello. hi beautiful good how to see you how are you i'm good this is my fiance hi. josh josh moogie have you guys ever met before no i talk to you about yes. him all the time okay i always see you okay <laughs> awesome how you feeling sir you grab goodness. some candy <laughs> hey we were, we were relaxing we were relaxing wait a okay. minute Mama got her hair pressed and curled. Oh, there we go. You yeah. Like, you like her? Looking beautiful. You know what it's all about. It's super healthy, too. It is healthy, EC. Yeah, it is. Thank you so much. Remember my baby said, where y'all at? They, they on the other side. I know, but we're just trying to breathe, y'all. Hey, sweetie. And other new, and looking real cute in this jumpsuit, yeah, too. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Blessed, blessed by the best. Oh my gosh. <laughs> um, so, have Whoa! hella packages to open. A lot of them, I know for sure, are wedding related. So I was waiting till mom got here to do this. Package number one. Oh. I know what this yeah, is. Don't miss your nails or anything. I didn't get them done yet. Okay. This is the robe for my girls that are gonna be getting dressed with me on Saturday. Those are really pretty. That's a beautiful, beautiful yeah. green. Like that. 
Now, I think most of you guys know, me and Josh aren't doing the formal bridal party or anything. We don't have bridesmaids, groomsmen, or anything like that. But we do have certain people in our lives that we're relatively close to that we still wanted to experience certain aspects of this process with, just informally. So if I did have formal bridesmaids, they would be with me that morning getting glam and cute and blah, blah, blah. So we're still having that moment. That's what's going on here. So it'll be me, my mom, my niece, and three of my girlfriends. And we're gonna get real cute and hey. it's gonna be a thing. Saturday morning. Friday. Wait a minute. No, because I didn't order a white one. What is this? Is this supposed to be my, uh, like y'all's green one? This is, is this it? Ooh, I need to change my top. Huh. I just don't know why it would have been in that package. Excuse me, can we shift this way? Just left, right, 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 right. Please do, please do. Yeah. This is the one that I wanted to take pictures with you and Maya. Oh, this is actually really pretty. Like, I want to get my makeup done in it. Ah, this is, this is cute. It's so long. It's really yeah, long. Even with you, it's gonna, so it's gonna drag it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Oh, I'm trying to imagine without this under top layer. Very bright it's light. So nice. Boy, food. it's so I like it. What do y'all think? Yeah, I like this. I love it. We gotta find yours, mom. The green, the green is made just like the white. Yes, so I got my mom. Dang it, back to what? Further than the 90s. Like yeah. Christmas, look at like Christmas. Oh, the acrylic Lady. displays. Oh, oh yeah. okay. Yeah. That's some wedding related mm -hmm. stuff. Yeah. Nina actually put me onto this. It's called a Happy Light Lucent. It's an LED light therapy lamp. What it looks like. And she said that it like basically if you don't get sun, I use it every day and it seems to be improving my, the light improves sleep, mood, energy during the winter where there isn't enough sunny days. Okay, so that's what the light mm -hmm. is for. So nice. that's why I bought that because we're entering into fall winter yes. mode. So see if it improves like mood and stuff. Mm -hmm. so I don't know. Do you feel like you suffer from seasonal depression when it gets cold? I think I suffer periodically. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There it is. Ooh. There it is. Ooh. There it is. <laughs> I don't know. Do you think I should tease them about this or let don't tell them? I would. Tell them? A little highlight. Okay. okay. Highlight. Give y'all a little highlight for the wedding. Mm -hmm. So something Thanks that we're doing. Yeah. <laughs> thank you. Hashtag thank you, Maya Deco, because I wasn't gonna say anything. <laughs> but long story short, we're going to have some disposable cameras around our reception and have like the CTA, so a call to action for our guests to snap some like candid pictures, some great moments from our special evening mm -hmm. and then pass the camera along. So at the end of when all is said and done, because I think I bought like three packs of this, so it's six cameras total. And I believe each camera has like 200, 200 fans. So we should have about 1,600 candid, <laughs> candid moments that our guests and family and friends are going to capture throughout reception that it's just gonna be dope to see because we won't know who's taking right. what and we won't know what exactly they captured until we get the film developed. We just thought it would be a cute little, you know, memory keepsake. I'm addicted to memories and photos as I think most of you guys know. I get it from my mama. We are definitely a memory holders or hoarders. I guess you could say memory hoarders. Beautiful. But it's necessary, I feel like. Like, I would love to show our kids this and like look back on all of this stuff when all of a sudden, done, even for ourselves. So that is something that we're gonna be doing. Let me share this back in the days. And I think that's the reason what captured me the most. I didn't have a lot of pictures. Right. That's what I grew up growing up as a baby, developmental stage. But I thought about it. Most people have shared with me when a house is caught a fire. Mm -hmm. What's one of the first things people try to collect? Their photos. Their photos. Mm -hmm. I would definitely try to do that too, actually. Collective memories. Yeah. Don't get me wrong, you need that important, yeah. you know, papers and documents and what have you too, but the second definitely be pictures. Yeah. Love it! So that's a fun little aspect that will be a part of our wedding. Here are the other two. Uh -huh. But uh, Amazon bodysuit for my bridal robe. Mm -hmm. I got my little so, or lace, cute. or lace, I'm telling you, yeah. love me some yeah. lace. That's pretty. And that's not my bridal robe, you guys, that's just my makeup robe. Here, yeah, <laughs> let's put it up here too. Yeah. Okay. Alright. Y'all so, getting some little exclusive tea over here. What is this? We've been into so much white lately, I'm, I, I'm feeling like I'm colorblind white. <laughs> I don't know what this is. Oh, wait! It's coming back to me. This very well is probably some Etsy something that I bought. Oh, what girl? What? This is what I bought him. Oh, that is so beautiful. What are you 
you guys gonna see this? I guess I can show y'all. We've been putting all the wedding stuff on Patreon, but y'all been riding, so I'll give y'all a little teaser. Oh, that's so thing. beautiful. But I got this box customized for Josh because it's a tradition that the bride and groom exchange gifts with each other, I guess. So I decided to do something a little sentimental. And I got like our date. You can see our date on the bottom, but it's how we write our date, the one infinity one, because we're getting married October, 22. which is 10, mm -hmm. the first, which is 01, mm -hmm. and then 2022, so yeah. Inside of it came with some cute little gifts Whoa. that have just different, and I need to write in this card, some mint and refreshment, oh, just cute so little like- sweet. just thoughtful gestures. You don't think I should show them? Such a teaser, we're teasing y'all now. Yeah, I'll, I'll tease a few things, yeah. yeah. So for example, it says, for my handsome groom in case you get cold feet. <laughs> Which ain't gonna happen, but it's like socks. And it's like in that little love note. And then there's mint for a fresh first kiss. So there's little cute sayings and stuff in here. The brand. Ah. Wait a minute. Is that what I think it is? Mm. My garter! Thunder thighs, baby. That's what he calls you in the hospital. Thunder thighs. Oh my gosh. Oh, good, it stretches there too. Guys, this is my garter. Well, one of them, I actually bought. Wait a minute, you bought more than one? I showed you, Mom. I bought two. Just in case one didn't work the right way. Amazon. She doesn't leave out nothing, does she? Nothing. Like that. Mm -hmm. Next. Ah, oh, hangers. Oh. <laughs> I don't know if I should hold it this way for you guys to see, because it's probably going to be backwards if I held it the other way. Ways. But it says Mrs. Mm -hmm. Water. Water. Yeah, it's, it's backwards for them. That's what it looks like. I got two of them, because I have two reception dresses. I'll hopefully be using them. Also, I'm going to be using mannequin bodies as well, but. Yeah, yeah. that was for me, baby. I don't know if it's sturdy enough and strong enough. Stop easy. it, mother. Josh's wedding shoes <laughs> just got it, came in, so he was just showing us that. All right, continuing mm. the process. Oh, I just bought myself this the other day. It's a nice. natural looking wig. I'll do a tutorial on that after the wedding. All said and done. Oh, I'll get into that later. Oh, because I gave Josh and mom, Mama Woodard, my other purse. Do you have a purse for that again? Yes. That's, that's like so one of my cute. favorite purses. And you can put it on your wrist. wrist. That's cute. That is cute. Okay, this is the backup garters. Oh, okay. And it's a little off-white too. But it was more so just in case this rhinestone for this garter mm. gets snagged my dress. Yes. So I got these just in case. Yeah, but not just any shoes. Oh. oh. Mrs. W. Girl, you don't miss nothing, do you? Yeah, those are cute. Those are darling. Only easy. Mrs. W. Only easy. Mm -hmm. Pearls. Do you all see these pearls? I don't know what this is. What kind of wrapping paper is that? Yeah, that's cool, though. Aww. Dear Easy, my name is Kitura. Kitura? Yes. Kitura. I hope I'm saying your name right. The owner of the Casey Collection with a K, which is a handmade sewing candle company that specializes in a variety of items with a twist. I first want to say thank you. I know you have thousands of follows and you don't fully know the extent of the impact that you have, but let me tell you, mm. I've been watching you since your college days. You are the only person who represented me, brown skin, natural hair, college student, track star. You showed who you were, personality and all. You helped build my confidence and you helped me find who I truly was in a time where there wasn't many of us. Fast forward years later and here you are again, helping me through the biggest moment of my life. Not only you, but Mr. Hydrant Hero <laughs> himself. The Josh and ECG channel literally helped me and my boyfriend in so many ways. Watching healthy relationships, communication, and overall black love has truly positively impacted our lives. After 10 long years, we did the work and we are now engaged. The Virgo in me is going insane and the Aquarius in him is trying to stop me from doing a thousand things at once. They're both Virgos and Aquarius as well. That's Isn't wild. That's something. There are not many positive black couples that is genuine, so again, thank you. Due to the role you both play 
family in my life, I wanted to say congratulations. <laughs> I made this candle inspired by hashtag quality ever after, oh our wedding God. hashtag. Both candles are made with all natural soy wax and the scents were hand blended by me. Scan code on the label connects to Apple Music, so I hope you enjoy the wedding playlist I personally created. Thank you and congratulations. You both pour positivity and love into everything and everyone around you. So here is some in return. Anything on my website is 30% off using quality ever after. Hashtag it's a wife, hashtag Virgo season, hashtag black love. Oh, oh my wow. gosh, Kitura. I'm holding on to this Kitura. forever. Ooh, I like how you, you said that. Thank you so much. I think this is a month or so ago and sent me a picture of a candle. I think this is what it is too. No wonder this is so unique. This is wrapping paper, y'all. I don't know if you all see it, but it's just so unique. Cause I'm pretty, I don't just give out my address and I do remember her asking like, hey, can I send this to you guys before your wedding? Oh man. Candle care and card, nice. Oh, she has a trim the wick. Oh, wow. This is in there too. Whoa! Is this what is this? A candle? What is this? Like to trim the wick. Every once in a while, like after the wick burns, uh -huh. and you take, you know, blow it out or whatever. The next time you light it again, you need to cut the tip just a little bit of the wick. Uh, why? What does that do? It makes it stronger. Okay. Wow! This is so elegant. For our Who does collection. This? Oh, this is a CEO. This is Kitura. Oh, wow. That That's the so name cool. of her brand as well. Definitely check her out, y'all. Looks like these are her candles on the back of it, too. www.thekcollection.com. And this box already smells so good. Okay, let's go ahead and oh, open go, this girl. up. Ooh, this smells bomb. Look, before I even open it. Oh, my God. No, this is no joke. <laughs> Let me smell it before we even open it. I don't know what heaven smells like. Ah! But it's like a heavenly it scent. It is, yes, it's very heavenly, that's true. <gasps> oh! <laughs> wow! This is done with so much love. Orange, papaya, and coconut. So much love. Look at this on candle. She put our engagement photo <laughs> on it. With a barcode to scan. I'm, we're gonna listen to that tonight. A barcode to scan a wedding playlist she put together for us. You better stop. Wow. Oh Lord, stop it, mom. Why are you crying? I don't mean the ugly cry. <laughs> Beauty gang, man. Wow. And the fact that it has our face on it, like that's just so special. Oh, and it's a black one. Oh, he has a Mr. Oh, Mr. 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 Josh, you gotta see this. This has clove, ginger, and amber. It smells masculine, it too. It does. It so. smells masculine. Look at this, Sadie, look. look. Mr. Oh, and Mrs. Oh, Candles. That's raw. So smell it, Josh. Put our bases on it? Yes. Hashtag quality ever after. We're exactly. Gonna... Yours is Mr. Oh, I see. Tell them about the music. Oh, yeah, and there's a wedding playlist she made us, so we have to check it. Bomb, right? <sighs> Soy candle. She handmade it herself. And you should read this. A sleeping mask. I love these little satin sleeping masks. Oh, this feels comfortable. So thoughtful. Thank you so, 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 so much. Katira, girl, yeah. you got something Kitura. on your hands with this brand. Yes. Absolutely love Kitura. and adore. Kitura. Thank you. Mm. It's actually really beautiful. It's beautiful. Yes. Kitura and the K Collection. Check her out, beauty gang. Cause she came through and clearly where scent meets sound. Wow, I wonder is that her overall Your brand? Does she sound. attach music to all her candles? Quality Ever After. Yes, again, y'all use Quality Ever After. There's one no T. hashtag with it. Oh, it has one T in it? One T in this one. Okay, we can put it on the screen, but use yeah. Quality Ever After on her website to get 30% off her candles, y'all. It looks like from neighborhood in Brooklyn, New York, the KC no, Collection was born. The KC Collection hand poured soy candles spark a vibe by using a unique blend of fragrances that bring a Caribbean aroma to everyone's home. In 2020, the owner, Kitura Charles, decided <laughs> to create amazing candles with a twist in the time where we needed yeah, it. Yeah, she taking the candle. <laughs> Sorry. The KC Collection has a curated playlist to match each scent that helps you indulge your senses by taking you to the most peaceful depths of your memories triggered by scent and sound. 
Wow, so she does this for all her kin. I'll put the, her information in the description box below as well so you guys can just directly go to her website because this is bomb. How creative is that? Thank you so much. Incredibly creative. Oh, my, I think this is your wig, honey. Uh-oh, whoa. You don't need it anymore, but hey, look. You never know. Oh, wow. Well, it doesn't matter. I just want to see if it was a decent gray. That's pretty. That's a pretty gray. And it's soft. Yeah. Just in case, y'all. Okay. Just in yeah, case. Yeah, we got my gray wig just in case. Here's a box to go with it. Back. <laughs> oh, this is for the reception. Look at this. Oh, oh, this is honeymoon energy. Yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. Look at that. Look at that. This for the honeymoon. Let me talk about it now, Mom. Thank you. My love. Oh, that's my cool song. I can't show y'all this one. Oh, yeah. That's gonna be easy. For yes. Yes. Yeah, that's what we have. Ah. Mm -hmm. Something might change, though, because this looks like that. Final mm. color, more so than okay. So mm -hmm. we'll try that on. Try that on. Can't show y'all that either. Sorry, mm -hmm. too much tea. Don't worry, Patreon don't even know about it. <laughs> uh, babe, oh, something else for you. Oh, they came out perfect. That is gorgeous. Y'all, I got his That's Val books. Val books, so his and hers. He's customized for jobs. Uh, Look, babe. Yeah. Aren't they so pretty to have lines? Well, you can do different things inside. We decided to put lines in ours so we could write. Look at them. I know this is not, what the hell is this? I know this is not my doggone bridal uh, what? robe. It, it's enclosed in this section thing. I bet when I open it, oh. it's gonna expand. <laughs> so oh, it's gonna happen there. Cause it is. Uh... It's big. That's why I'm like. Oh, I already hear it. Oh wow, they suction it. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. You know you have to get on your stepping stool for this one. Stop, girl. Oh, wait, what is this? Extra That's the belt. I think it is. I was wondering, like, what package has this? Because it yep. said it delivered. I did not Ooh. see it. Oh my God. Ooh. How are you in this Ooh. thing? I see a sleeve. Okay. Okay. Yeah, one sleeve. Here's the other. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. okay. Like that, like that. What is it looking like? Mm -hmm. Oh. Very Oh, baby girl. Too much spring. Oh. All the way back. Have y'all ever seen the train thing going on? Ooh. <laughs> Honestly, y'all, I got all my dresses customized, and so oftentimes people get a bridal robe, like what they're getting ready in, or after they're glammed and stuff, they put on a bridal robe and they get that customized. I, I didn't have time for all of that, and I wasn't trying to pay all of that. This was just 150 or 149 on Amazon, and it looks expensive, but it ain't. I love this. It's beautiful. They're beautiful hangers now. Yeah. And I'm gonna knock we'll, use, we'll use these for them. That'll be pretty. All right, so that's satisfied. Cause I was real mad. I'm like, none of these packages look big enough to have my something that massive. They suctioned it. Mm. All right. What is that? The box is all beat up. Beat the hell up. Oh, mm -hmm. this oh, was supposed oh. to be another Mrs. Woodard hanger, but it was supposed to be way more pretty mm -hmm. and aesthetic than this. Hold it up, hanger. Hold that thing up. Yeah. No way. Not on our watch. Not with my daughter. The Hold the box up. Hold the box up. They utilized that box. Unbelievable. It's so cute and quaint. This is perfect. This came out perfect. Oh man. So Whoa, you guys, Lord. since my um, since my dad won't be able to be here this weekend in physical form, I know he's there in spirit and uh I decided wow. to buy this like cool. little garter jewelry. I got it customized with, uh, mm -hmm. but it's a picture of him, picture of me with him mm -hmm. when I was a baby, mm -hmm. and it has a little slogan on it. I will forever honor thy father and mother. Mm -hmm. That is so thoughtful. Only you, only Thank you, Easy. That is so beautiful. It is actually. I love the way this came out. <sighs> So this goes around my bouquet. Oh, that's where it goes. Mm -hmm. So 
still form of him like walking me down the aisle. That's, oh my God. This is incredible. They did a great job. <sighs> breathe. Breathe. I'm a breathe. Oh, I'm keeping that forever. I though. know you are. It looks so good. Did you think of, did you think of something like this? This is the brand, by the way, you guys. Um, that I got. Oh it my was gosh. Like evident. It was definitely evident a month ago or so. <laughs> when I found out we're getting married on his country's Independence Day. Come on, Mama. No ugly. <laughs> It's just, I think this is from my, my, my. Happy birthday, EC. I remember you said you liked some of the things I had when I visited. <laughs> Hope you enjoy. Love you from a mind. Wow. She bought me a little workout set. She had a, such a cute pink workout set on when she was here. Aww. And she got me a sonic facial cleansing brush. Right, because she was using, what you get up in here? <laughs> What are you talking about? Oh. Minding my business. No, you're not minding your business up in this. My, my, my business. room is my business. Our business in four days. Uh-uh, Josh. All our business. <laughs> what the? What are you all looking for? Business. What are you looking for? A blessing. What are you talking about? No, I'm just uh, I'm looking for something. What? <laughs> I'll find it. <laughs> you got me messed up, bro. Yeah, no. That was the last of things though, you guys. I gotta send a picture to Maya to thank her. She kept asking me, did you get it? Did you get it? I'm like, girl, what are you talking about? Sonic facial cleansing brush. I did see her using this when she was here and I was like, ooh, what is that? She bought me one. They do know she's a Virgo too, right? I think so. Y'all know my niece is a Virgo too. She's like 16 oh days. But yes, y'all, all right. That concludes the package opening session. Y'all got a little bit of tea, a little bit of insight. Hope you guys enjoyed. I guess I'll check in with you guys whenever we're in this next phase of getting ready for this wedding. Cha, 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 cha. Okay. <laughs> what up, y'all? So it has been a fat minute since I last checked in with you guys. Believe it or not, we are at this point less than 24 hours a day away from wedding day. And my handsome just got back from his haircut. <laughs> Yes, I got a really good. Like. Yeah, nope. Give us the geometry. Don't play. Oh, no. Don't play now. Oh, oh, no, no, no. I ain't trying to cut the screen. Uh huh. The geometry is there. Uh huh. Yeah, Give us that back. Let's just back real quick. Oh. Ew. Oh. I don't no. hurt nobody. <laughs> Oh, no, oh my gosh, so Bay got his hair done today. We gotta wash it before we part ways today because he will be staying in a hotel this evening. And I will be with my girl. Is the heat on? You hot? I was this morning. Oh, I mean, cold? Gee. I don't know. I don't know a little bit. Lots has transpired since the last time that I checked in with you guys. Um, the devil's been working over over time definitely will have a solid ass story time and even a late night vent session for you guys after all is said and done definitely won't stop no show and no shine when you got god behind you so pushing forward this is our last day as i was saying as fiance okay yeah. as we're finally transitioning you know we're transitioning put some respect on our name <laughs> Um, so we have a few errands to run today because the devil was working I was supposed to have a nail appointment earlier this week that I had to cancel because it was something else more important But thankfully because God on the counterpart be coming through my girl um, Moogie you guys have seen her. She actually did my feet in this vlog. He had a little opening for me available today It's Friday, so um, I'll be going to that appointment in a half an hour or so And right now Bay and I are in route to the dry cleaners because we dropped off one of my reception dresses that it fit but it didn't fit as comfortable as it could or should and just needed some adjustments here and there so fingers crossed that this time around it feels really really good I really trust in this woman's um, expertise because we've gotten a few things like done. done from her and Josh um actually got his pants resized. yeah his pants resized for the wedding as well so no, she's hooking us up and then I'm trying to think there's something else I mean really for me at least I'm finalizing my vows today yeah, um, I was doing a little bit of that in the car while I was waiting for my hair. Oh yeah? Yeah. Yeah? How long is yours? I was timing myself this morning. What'd you get? What'd you get? 4.30. 4 minutes, 30 seconds? Yeah, almost. I I, I, I won't go over five. Almost five. So how much did you write? Like a page and a half, two pages? It's just a decent amount. 
a lot. You know I'm a rider. I know. So what is your, but what is, how long would you say yours is? Have you tried to say it through? I've been going gold for like two and a half minutes. Oh no, I'm gonna be talking too long. Oh baby, I wanna hear what you have to say. I like Aww. your words of affirmation. Aww. I'm just really good at covering ground. Oh, I'm, th I'm just thorough, you know? Yeah. Seven years. I so, well, it'll be beautiful regardless. His boys, well, our boys, but it's his boys, like football teammates from college, did come into town. They started funneling into town yesterday. We had just a good time kind of kicking it. I didn't bring the camera around because we haven't seen each other in a little minute. I just like having some quality, undisrupted time. Real life time, you know what I mean? Real just life. like being present in the moment, no camera. Just regular Josh and EC because that's who they met in college. And those are the people that like know us before we've become who we are, you know? So those type of moments are really, we cherish those a lot. I'll be taking you guys through the day. I might bring you guys, we'll see. We'll see how I'm feeling, what I decide to capture. But we don't have that formal bridal party thing, so that shouldn't take too, too long. Quick flow in and out. What are you and your boys? You got I really plan? don't know, but don't I know, know all, I'm trying to get like all my boys together. Right, so college and the friends yes. after. College, uh, my, Oh, high, well, I only got one buddy that I really kicked with from high school, Jordan. That was grade school. Yeah. That's your best friend. That's like my best. That's my your best brother. Brother, really my brother. Yeah. So my brothers, my friends, all my brothers. Yeah. All my brothers. All his <laughs> brothers. I want them all together. I know. So I don't know what we're going to do, but it's going to be lit. Now, I don't want us to go too hard because tomorrow. Everybody need to be up, refreshed, yeah. and ready. And we're going hard as hell yeah. tomorrow. Right. So I, I go like, you know, hard. Uh-huh. You go, not, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, huh? Hard. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. We're not like hard. Uh-huh. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> if we go like hard, uh -huh. it's gonna be hard, harder to yeah. get up in the morning. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? So I need to get up, be ready in my right mind. Mm -hmm. you know? I haven't had any nervous jitters or anything like that yet. So Me neither. I'm not nervous. I'm not this either. Is planned. This was ordained by God. Yeah. This has been approved and reapproved. God has affirmed it so many times that I have no nerves. I think that's I, where I'm I at. I literally too. have no nerves about it. And everyone keeps saying, like, are you nervous? No. Right. Or God's been telling me this was supposed to happen for forever. <laughs> <laughs> right. And then a lot of people have been asking me, like, you seem just very calm for a bride. And also the drama that happened earlier this week, I'll eventually tell y'all about. And I'm like, well, one, it is because I've been developing a closer relationship with God. But two, I know God has placed me in good hands with this man like there's not much that's changing other than people really respecting it's this respect, this dynamic know. like a piece of paper to solidify like we're officially husband and wife but how we've treated and handled each other this whole relationship has been to that caliber anyway so I'm just excited for people to see our love displayed in the best way that we know how possible and just to celebrate what our love feels like because I feel like what we've created for this wedding experience is super untraditional but it's very us and it's very like Josh and Love. Yeah. So, yeah, y'all. Let's get out of here. Yeah. You better get to your yeah. nail I do. I do. So, here we go. Okay. Yeah. My nail inspo for the day. And we got Moogie in the cut. <laughs> Okay. We are en route to our wedding venue, you guys. We're actually two minutes away. We're the last ones because we have to go pay for some last minute food of a vendor for tomorrow's festivities, AKA our wedding. It's a bit surreal, but we're both very excited. It's gonna be a great, or good old funky time, as Chelsea good would say. Old funky it's gonna time. be a good old funky time. Everything we wanted was pulled off, literally. And our wedding planner's at the venue right now because obviously they've already started setting up because the wedding is tomorrow and she said it looks bomb like Mr. And Mrs. Winter coming soon coming soon <laughs> <laughs> Shot first. Oh. Mm. Wow. That was the 
Oh wow. Hmm. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Whatever. Mm -hmm. Nobody heard me knocking on this door. We did. I knocked. I'm almost getting shit in. Did you hear that thing? Oh, okay. Interesting. That's crazy. I need to take a shot. Yeah. 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 Are we all supposed to have the lemon? I don't have a lemon. Yeah, we supposed to have a lemon. Tell us the rules, Stephanie. Tell us the rules. Hey y'all, I'm Maya, Issy's niece, if you didn't know, and today is the day of Issy's wedding, so it's the morning time, so I got my makeup done by Issy's make makeup artist, Tony, she did a really good job, and now I'm going to show y'all the bridal suite, Issy's getting her makeup done, but y'all will be able to say hi to her, say hi, hi to all her girls, her mom, all of that, so let's take y'all in. Alright y'all, so here is the bridal suite. Here's grandma, this is mom, getting our hair done by Dom. These dresses are gorgeous, aren't they? This is the wedding dress, this is the reception dress, and this is the final reception dress where Isi has the most flexibility. She's getting her makeup done, some of our gowns and her robes. My robe is hanging up there, Isi got us all green robes. And then this is Isi getting her makeup done, say hi! Hello. How are you feeling, bride? I'm starting to feel good. It's starting to feel good. I think we need mimosas. Yes. So I can get woo, woo, woo. Okay. I'm doing good. Why are you doing the amazing job on the bridal suite. Got Tony in the cut, as always. Hey, Tony. Okay. Okay. The face down. <laughs> you look gorgeous. Oh. It's going to be a great day. We've had some minor setbacks, but nothing is too more powerful or, you know, going to overpower what God has planned. Yes. That's right. All right. Have a great makeup session. All right. Dom, do you have anything you want to say to the vlog? Ooh, now I'm my makeup on. Oh, yeah. You look yeah, good, though, Dom. <laughs> Chelsea, do you? Hi. Okay, let me get you in the lighting. I just want to say this is a great day. I'm happy to be here. It's a pleasure. It's a privilege. And it's lit. <laughs> Imani, do you want to say anything? Nina, do you want to say anything to the vlog? We are all very happy to be here. Alright, right, now we're gonna go to the mother of the bride. Grandma, here. what would you like to say? say? Hi babies, you know what's going on right now. A big day. This is the day the Lord has made. We're gonna rejoice and we're gonna be glad in it. And it's gonna be a wonderful, wonderful festivity. <laughs> Watch out. Our daughter. Entering another chapter of her life of womanhood. Cheers! Yeah. Happily ever after. Happily ever after. Happily ever after. Happily ever after.
welcome to sweetest day 2022 in the woodard household y'all so i've been up the last about two hours getting our apartment together while josh has been asleep i don't even think he knows today's sweetest day and to be honest with you guys I admit, I'm pretty bad with like keeping up when Sweetest Day is. However, a friend recently reminded me and now I won't forget because it's two weeks after our wedding. Go figure. Anyway, I prepared a little King's Day for Bay. Different things throughout the day. I think I'm even going to, um, just because he really deserves it beyond it just being Sweetest Day. He is an amazing man. The greatest gift from God that I've ever received and just... I want to start taking that title as wifey for lifey more serious in the sense of just being more intentional about how I show love to him and cater to him and um, my romanticism. Because I was on point back in the day in them college days, for those of you guys who have been following for the longest, I was like the most romantic person ever. And then I just fell off over the years and there wasn't a really big reason why. But now that I'm a wifey for a lifey, I want to get back into that plus more. Like I just want to do more. Um, the best advice or the biggest piece of advice that I feel like you always hear as a married couple is to always continue dating each other, loving on each other the same way you did when you first started. So this is my step first step in the right direction in terms of that so i'm gonna show you guys what i have going on what i have set up so far see if bay is up in the first place to get his day started all right first things first that's our bedroom door i lined rose petals leading to his whole spa setup situation so i'm gonna like give him a facial give him a massage x y and z i actually already have candles going all the candles somebody gifted us this candle for um, our wedding i love it so much <laughs> we'll have my nice little personalized love note on the mirror kind of see it happy sweetest day husband you see four more rose petals leading to the washroom our second washroom and i have a nice little setup going on here a little diffuser some candles okay and Got him a little bath going with some Naruto. Josh is a huge anime fan, so I just thought it'd be cute to have Naruto already set up. Another It's a King's Day little message. Got him some apples and peanut butter going on. I think I'm actually gonna start him off with this. Also got a little uh, eye mask for him to put on. Ah! And I haven't done this for a long time, and I think I know he needs it. He very much so deserves it. And and I'm just excited to get into this little wifey for lifey romantic bag. So I hope this inspires some of you guys to make sure you are showing love to your partners the same way that they show you love. Because I do feel like men, let's get this party started. Happy <laughs> sweet day! <laughs> oh, this is sweet! <laughs> <laughs> this is, am I getting a pamper day? You're in your love now. King's Day. <laughs> okay. Let's get it going, baby. No, sir, but. We're off to a great start. Come here. Yeah, yeah. Come here, Mrs. Water. Mm. Oh, I'm ready. Sorry. Of all the days I choose to sleep in. Bro, I would have had that for you next year. I, I, I tried. No clue, right? No. It's okay. Let me show you your first surprise. Okay. But then. <laughs> okay. It's a great attempt, though. So. Thank you, thank you. Close your eyes. Close oh, your my. eyes. Uh, another surprise? Close your eyes. Man, what's going on? That's not. We're going to go to your first one. So close your eyes and give me your hand, sir. Gee, you really worked this one. <laughs> Actually, you don't have to close your eyes. Wow. You could just go ahead and open the door. I Did you see, see it. it? I see it. Oh me, oh my. Oh. Yeah. Thank you, baby. Of course, baby. Alrighty, little update for you guys. Bay has been chillaxing in the bath for about an hour now. I think I ran to the grocery store. Actually, I don't know why I just sat down. I just ran to the grocery store to Costco. Oh, 
Just finished making King's Day brunch. Pancakes, turkey bacon, hickory maple sausage. FaceTime mom, she taught me how to make grits real quick. Some cheesy grits. Got some eggs. Pancake is over here. All my pancakes were straight tins today, you guys. Straight tins. And some real love into this food, okay? The Lord bless this woman that I have received with your blessing. Thank you for my wife. She is my greatest treasure. And she treats me like the king that you wish me to be. Mm -hmm. I will respect her and treat her as the queen you wish her to be. Thank you for the food. Thank you for the sacrifice and time that went into making this meal for me. Thank you for the blessings. Thank you for a good woman. Love you, Mr. Woody. Love you, Mrs. Woody. Love these cups, girls. Love these cups, girls. Cheers to Billy Kingdoms. That's old boy? Yup. My mom remember she was raped, and I was like, she said it smacked, so let's give it a try. Oh, boy, Mmm. Good God. Good God. Good God. that for me for a second please okay now we are entering into part three of the sweetest day 2022 evening Bay. So oh <laughs> it's freshly washed got his hair washed we twist a little bit we moisturize and whatnot it's real right. luscious the crown right most definitely yeah. and it's definitely luxurious thank you oh it's a great team effort you know Damn. That voice came out real nice. They did. It's gonna look really, really nice. It's growing long too. Yeah, no, oh my goodness. <laughs> but okay, now we are entering into phase three of the night, which sir, I think you already know, but it is a facial. You're so ready? I'm sorry. Okay. We finished phase three of Sweetest Day 2022. Locks on point, thank you, babe. Uh huh, uh huh. Locks on point, thank you, babe. Mm -hmm. Thank God, you know. Yeah, 100%, 100%. Yeah, yeah. At the same time, you know, but you get me right. Okay. I got some volume here. You do have some value, man. Yeah, man. It's really gross. <laughs> I love it. You look great. Yeah. You look great so, too. Oh well, come on, stop. Yeah, rock on. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>